So, let me call you a happiness is seeing the big Z in your rear view mirror. Oh boy. Are you kidding me? So, Sugar Wars, Blast War, Textile Wars, Cocaine Cowboys, Plutonium Wars. <laughs> so, Ukraine's reporting that two big wigs were taken at gunpoint by Tsar Putin's cronies. They got rocket launchers. None to see. None to see. Just the biggest storage of uranium-235 on the face of the fucking earth. Six fucking reactors. Fucking, the power's just been knocked down. Running on backup diesel generators. Nothing to see. It's no biggie. No biggie. Fucking. You know, I want to say this to all these radio gaga motherfuckers all over the internet. I mean, and people that claim they're experts and activists said, where's your field work? No, seriously. Show me your fucking field. I mean, well, those blah, blah fuckers are enough to make you fucking sick. They don't have a clue. So, Edward Snow job. So, I asked Edward Snow job. He spoke up in Park City on the thing. And, I mean, I've had a connection with him clear back fucking anonymous. He's a fraud. Now remember, he was headed to South America. He said, so he swore his allegiance. He swore his allegiance to Tsar Putin this week. So the CIA rat himself, the KGB rat double agent, who's called Edward Snowjob, who's a con man from hell, has Russian citizenship and a full passport. Not to mention Lindsay Mills. Have him up, baby. Dual citizenship. Fucking KGB, CIA in bed. The nuclear... I asked Glenn Greenwald right to his fucking face. Right there at the university and all the face. Oh, we love you. There's all kinds of stuff out there. Snowjob handed you the chip. You put out less than one-tenth of one percent weekly. Where the fuck's the rest of the chip? He literally ran from me. We've seen what a fraud he is. He's... Operation Foxconn News contributor. So, Edward Snowjob has fucking pledged allegiance to fucking czar fucking criminal mass killer. Putin kills children. Putin kills... I mean, he's a fucking creepy evil fucker. Snowjob. The United States government, and himself, for that matter. I knew Aaron Swartz personally, by the way. Why do you think they kettle me so fucking hard? If you're contemporized on fucking YouTube right now, you're a zero burger. Edward Snowjob. The self-proclaimed and the United States, he says he's the greatest hacker in the fucking world at the time. I worked for the CIA. He claims he was special forces. I come from a special forces family right here. My dad, the special force marine. Oh, there were no. Oh, yes, there were. Fucking killed. My uncle. Oh my! Look up my uncle Claude Blanche. Look up her. Just look him up. Look him up. Fucking beasts. I mean, fucking some of the greatest athletes in the history of this country. Fucking minds like traps. Those are Twiggy's not a special force guy. Broke his legs jumping out of a plane. No, he's connected. The CIA and the KGB are all bloodlines. Ask Jill Stein. Ask fucking Hunter Biden. Ask fucking General Flynn. Ask Paul Matford. All roads lead to Ukraine. Huh? Edward Snowjob. I was the top of the CIA all the way to the top clearance. And how about that fucking phony CIA piece of shit fucking rat? What is that Woody Harrelson creepy ass fucking movie? Now who's Woody Harrelson's father? What, 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 what? That's your bone killer. Oh, that Oliver Stone piece of shit. Pro nuker fucking CIA fucking rat. Snow job. Got all the way to the top of the heap. I had the number one surveillance clearance all the way. I hacked in and found out there was another top. Who's the other top? Global oligarchs. When he's sitting next to the greatest global oligarch maybe in history. Tsar Putin. I thought he was headed to... South America. All we hear is Radio Goo Goo. Radio Gaga. Radio Goo Goo. So nothing to see. Don't fucking worry. I've been at the Big Z multiple times. I'm the guy that named it the Big Z. Fuck the field work I've done over my career over the years. Blow your fucking mind. And so many multiple fucking fonts. Fuck it. I don't eat, sleep, drink it. 
I literally fucking sleep with it. <laughs> Give it two months to live, 11 years in a bone marrow clinic. All these years fucking walking the coast, dead tide pools at your feet, Edie. Look, we don't want the contemporary sheep around here. They're worthless. I spent all those years policing my sites for fucking blah, 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 fucking moron comments. You know, we have a lean, clean, fucking postgraduate fucking army here that gets results. The accomplishments we've had, and we'll continue to have them. We're not going to get any fucking credit. But we are kicking their fucking ass in so many ways you don't even know. That's why they're afraid of us. That's why they're afraid of me. Go ask fucking Mike fucking Lee. Flask him. These nuclear fucking CIA, KGB... Pro now think about this. We have a full blown out fucking proxy war. One of the greatest, nasty, dirtiest fucking wars in human history. And Edward Snowjob has now swore allegiance to Russia. Sitting next to Putin now... He has access, he did, to the top clearance of the United States CIA. Now think about this, think about this. Oh, you don't think, and he, Putin gave him that. He swore allegiance to Putin. <laughs> you think Putin knows what the U.S. is doing before they do it? Snow job? Oh, I thought he said, how, how did he end up in Russia? You end up on 60 fucking minutes. Blake Barrett to Leslie Stahl on 60 minutes. Took, Blake Barrett fucking at 60 minutes, 2,888 days. Tell you, look, Kevin Weiss told you one hour about Fukushima. What are these courts? It's like all these so-called anti nuclear acts around the world. And I want people to understand this. I don't talk about this enough because I don't dare. Let that ring. Drop your fucking spent fuel. I used to spend a lot of time in Vienna, a lot of time in different circles and places and things. The true oncology and the true anti nuclear fucking movement inside Russia got the fuck out. I used to go into Russia. I won't talk about, because I can't hear, talk about some of the things in Ukraine and Russia. I can't. But I quit going into Russia. I quit in Ukraine a long time ago because I knew what was going on. Putin will kill you. Just kill you. So some of the real grassrooters and the good activists that are in Russia, we secretly meet in Austria and Vienna. We used to, and we talk like this. They're hiding there. I mean, I used to do so much work with them in. Remember Pussy Riot? <laughs> what happened to them? Well, it's fucking silver lead real quick. Putin will fuck around. He sure loves snow job. So they've detained two of them. I mean, it's just the biggest nuclear whacker of spent fuel, uranium-235, on the face of the earth. The nuclear reactors are not there to make sugar wars, textile wars, <laughs> the last wars, cocaine cowboys, <laughs> these historic fucking wars, this nightmare, plutonium wars. That's the prize, the big Z. Always oh, is it the prize. There's a lot of historic work that goes beyond behind the scenes by Kevin Blanche, a lot. But, you know, I used to... I'm up against so much. They're after me all the fucking time. You know, they, they're they afraid of me. They know I'm a real activist that gets results, and I believe in violence they do. <laughs> Snowjob, the big Z. Edward Snowjob swore allegiance to Russia. To Tsar Putin. With the top fucking CIA surveillance cl fucking classification, with all the secrets, the chip, he hand to Greenwald, he handed it to Laura. Laura's the MIT media endowment, fucking Aaron Swartz that killed Aaron Swartz's daughter. Why would he hand it to those two? Because it was a setup to kill anonymous Aaron Swartz. I knew Aaron Swartz personally. It's no job. Swearing allegiance. Look at this fucking big boy coming in. 
military plant of some sort. Let me see this one around here. What the fuck is this? Hoping to get a sun tour tonight. We might get a sun tour this time of year. So he's done it. He swore allegiance. You don't think the KGB and the CIA and what's going on in Ukraine, this proxy war, young Russian soldiers, wrong, young Ukrainians being used as can of fodder. The UN voted today like 161 to 30 something that Israel has to get rid of all their nuclear weapons. Yeah, like that's going to happen. They also voted that the United States has to get rid of them. And they, for the first time in history, Nuclear weapons are against international law. But who says fuck international law? Russia and the United States. Fuck the military industrial arts complex. So. God. Don't be missing like that. Can't drop your fucking spent fuel pools. snow job what a sham this country's turned out to be yay we're at the university now we love greenwald that's uh, 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 uh. operation fox con <laughs> Fuck. you've been so hard when fukushima the greatest event in human history when they can cover that one up this fucking good billy yeehaw I got a big collection of all these. I've been collecting them for fucking many, many decades. All made in the USA. Got them from all over the world. It's got to be my favorite. It's got to be my favorite. It's so cool. It's got to be my favorite. Fucking snow job. In the name of Aaron Swartz, in the name of my father, who they nuked to death in the United States, say, if you're contemporized on YouTube right now, <laughs> you're a joke. They don't fuck around. Snow job. So he swore allegiance. So we got a sun tour tonight. I think we're gonna. It's trying to do it. It's that time of year. Fucking. Okay. Just rocket launchers Russia has inside the biggest storage of Uranium-235 fucking five on the face of a weapons grade. Just running on backup diesel fucking fuel generators with spent fuel fucking for decades. Hundreds of thousands of tons of it. <laughs> Who's going to tell us if something really goes wrong there? The New York Times? <laughs> the Washington Jeff Bezos poet? Oh, the IAE. Okay, okay. I have the Blanche box at the IAEA, and so... I showed you my fucking field work. Show me yours. I tell people that all the time. Not to mention my marine biology work. <laughs> you know, I'm transparent. I'm out in fucking front about everything. I showed you yours. Show me. I showed you mine. Showed me yours. You know, but like I said, if you're contemporized on, let's go. I need a car. It's so fucking bad. I was thinking about today, all this fucking work I do. I got, I mean, I don't know how I survive. I, don't, I really don't. I barely do. Thank you to everybody who has supported this historic work. My work. So, Let's keep going. Let's keep going. So, Snow Job is War Allegiance to Tsar Putin.
Yay, Lindsey Mills having my baby, the pole swinger in the bunker in Hawaii, where they run the cover up of Fukushima. Classified Kevin Lash. That's a fact. Kevin Lash. There's all kinds of stuff I'd like to tell people, order, but I can't on this YouTube channel. I mean, I got stories that my path that would blow your fucking mind. I got information that would blow your fucking mind. You know, and so I can't on YouTube. I can't. By the way, I've been in fucking plastic handcuffs so many fucking times, it's unbelievable. I don't break the fucking law. I mean, well, I mean, when they classify me, well, I don't know. I invented the term internet fucking kettling. <laughs> They've kettled me so hard. Of course they have. Come on, man. Anybody who's fucking real activist, fuck, they're afraid. You're, you're going to get no fucking traction, please. Hmm. Still no birds. We used to talk in code on fucking YouTube, but I don't know. Brilliant. Well, fucking squash any real activists out, kill them. They're pretty well fucking dead. That's fucking Aaron Swartz. Got a drip, Andy. Wait for that sun pillow. There it comes. Bang. We got a flip. Yeah. That's three times. You've never dropped fucking spent fuel for me three times. Maybe today's the day. That the major nuclear disaster will happen at the Big Z or TikTok Diablo Canyon Clock. I spoke there the other night. Oh, we'll get it up. By law, they have to put the transcript up, but I know how they go on that. We'll see that in the year 2525 if Manny's still alive. play baseball. I'm going to put my bat up. How about those World Cup games today? Whoa. Whoa, it's bright. Whoa. The Stifle Tower's back in Salt Lake tonight. I don't, I hate the fucking NBA anymore, but. Wonder what's gonna happen. Clouds move too quickly. Get my light up. Get my hand. Takes a thief. Spent fuel fucking they busted again at another airport, Harry Reid International. It takes a thief. Remember that old show?
works for the DOE. First non-gender government employee of the feds. It takes a fee. Whatever. Edward Snow job. I'm just waiting. Just waiting. Edward Snow job. A swore allegiance. He has swore allegiance to Tsar Putin. Now just remember again. Self-proclaimed greatest hacker in the world. Who got to the top. And hacked in and found there was another top. It was the other top on 60. Took Lake Bart Leslie Stahl in 60 minutes. 2,880 days. Tell you what Kevin Blanks told you in the first hour. In denial. Hear no nuclear energy evil. Smell no nuclear energy evil. Taste no nuclear energy evil. The five fucking. See no nuclear energy evil. Well, I bet you they're thinking that in Ukraine. You think? You think they're thinking that? I was in the bone marrow transplant center. 2011, that long stint, 2011-2012. There's two guys from two different nuclear actors in Illinois. They're both dying. They were younger than me. They were in epic denial. Well, there we go. Epic denial. They both died quick. They didn't stay long, alive very long. It's a hell of a fight. Great Salt Lake, what's left of it. Mitt Romney right here, got five million to study it. <laughs> when did it start going dry till 2011? It's another Fukushima 22. What do you think Snowden is really up to? Cover up Fukushima, I'm here to tell you. Again. long video it's turning into. Stay in tune. 